What's up guys, this is Nate from Xcode Dev and welcome back to Cybertech. So this is going to be a tour of the Mac App Store and uh, to start it off, the Mac App Store uh, just got released today and there's already over a thousand paid and free apps. So that's pretty amazing. Um, so as you can see, this, there's a bar right up here that has featured top charge categories, purchases and updates. The featured page, this looks exactly like on your iPhone, Apple Touch, or iPad. It's pretty cool, actually. Um, the featured page has this big banner up here. It says three uh, popular apps over here. And uh, then it says new and noteworthy. And you can obviously hit see all. And as you can tell, there are actually um, Angry Birds and a lot of other games that were on the iPad or uh, iPhone. And I think that's pretty cool. Um, I already have the Angry Birds, so I'm not going to buy it again for my computer. But um, some people might be into, you know, uh, gaming on your Mac. This is a new form of gaming on your Mac. Uh, that's what I think. Um, but so basically, as you scroll down here, you can see what's hot, and they have other uh, apps right here, and of course staff favorites. And then on the side, you have top grossing, uh, top free, and of course top paid. So uh, let's go ahead and go to top charts. So this just came out today. So let's see what's already uh, the most downloaded here. So it looks like Angry Birds is one of the top paid. Let's hit see all, see how this works. Okay, so it lists them out and it should give you to, oh, look at that. It gives you to 180, 180 top paid. So that's a lot. Of course, Angry Birds is number one. No surprise there. Um, so this is the top paid. Uh, I'm not going to buy any right now, but uh, I'm just going to go back to top charts and top free. And um, let's let's actually install one of the top free here. Uh, I'm going to install oh, this solitaire one looks good. So I'm going to click on the solitaire. This is how it works. And obviously you can see a screenshot here. And here's a uh, little you know uh, information about it just like on the regular app store and then you have customer ratings down here and uh, you can see everyone likes it sick for that guy what's up with him <laughs> um, so mostly you know it's pretty good so I'm gonna download it here so uh, then I obviously would just enter my password there I'll block that out <laughs> no one so I just uh, downloaded it there so just finished installing, but uh, you can't see my dock here because I'm on my other monitor. But um, I'll just drag it over here. I'll open the program. The icon looks exactly like that. So here's the program. I mean, it runs perfectly. Uh, I can play solitaire, you know. Um, have you, you know, play solitaire here. So uh, that's how you download an app. I mean, pretty simple, smooth, uh, you know, nothing. I didn't have any problems so far using it. Um, but... Uh, yeah, so they have a bunch of top paid uh, app, top free apps and paid. Um, let's go to categories here. So it looks like the categories the same way. You have social networking. You have the Twitter app right there. You have video, iMovie they have. And um, this is really great. Um, this is just, I, I, like, I love it. I mean, so let's go over to purchases here. Well, actually, um, I only got two apps, uh, download Twitter and Solitaire, so it shows you the apps you installed, and obviously if there was any updates, it would tell you the updates. So this runs very smoothly, just like um, on your iPhone or iPod Touch, and you can also, or iPad, and you can also get uh, pretty big discounts. Like uh, if I click on iLife 11 here, uh, this is only $15 each, which adds up to around $45, and that is much cheaper than buying iLife 11. So that is pretty cool. Um, this Mac App Store, it's really cool. Just came out. i um, giving you guys the first look. Uh, so if you like this, obviously, please subscribe to CyberAce TV here and my channel, Xcode Dev, and I cover uh, technology videos just like this. And I also teach you how to make uh, apps just like this. So um, yeah, thanks for watching, and see you later.